have that. Then take this piece. Decide which side is going to be your front. Uh, for me, I'm going to say this is going to be my front right here, so I'm just going to mark with a little F. Okay. Um, now you probably shouldn't mark it with the F unless you're going to paint this, but I don't recommend that. So uh, just know in your head which side is going to be the front. And then flip it over onto the back. Now using the back, you're going to want to tape this down and actually put your mag, whatever, in the pouch so you know how big the uh, flap has to be. Put it there. And then sew your uh, thing on. Make sure it can wrap all the way around. Okay. So I put mine right here. Let me actually take that down a little bit better. Alright, so once it's like that, it should be able to wrap fully around and hold your item in there. I mean, it's alright if there's spaces right here, but... They're similar sizes right now. So um, then once you have that, you're almost done. All you have to do is add Velcro and add the two back straps. Now take your Velcro, take your pieces, uh, as most of you, well, I hope you know, Velcro has two different types of pieces. Go together, they stick. Now, um, you're gonna want a tiny little piece of each. Maybe just a little strip, okay? Like that long. So I'm just going to draw out with my pencil where you should add the Velcro. But make sure your thing's in there. Make sure it wraps around. And I'm just going to put, I would just put my Velcro right there. And right there. Velcro right there. And right there. Enough to where. They line up and they'll stick together firmly to where your thing won't actually like just drop out. And then put your Velcro there. Um, sew it in. Actually, the Velcro I used had a sticky side on the back, so I recommend that too. Um, but also, you should probably sew through it just to make sure. And if you do use the stick, sticky Velcro, make sure you let it sit for at least 24 hours before you. Um, before you latch it and then unlatch it because it might rip it off and the adhesive hasn't fully set in. Okay, so once you have that, that will fold closed and stuff. Um, then leave your, leave your item in there. Take your two things. Um, now, I already have my Velcro squares drawn out right here. You're gonna wanna make sure your Velcro squares are down, facing down. And then, actually let me trim these real quick. Okay. Now they should be the right size to where they can fit right here. And these, the purpose of these things is um, they will loop onto your belt. Okay. As you can see right here, they, they loop into your belt and then latch on and hold it onto your waist. So then... It's actually like a pouch. Once you have that, making sure your Velcro is face down. Sew them, or in my case, take them on. Make sure they are secure and even, and uh, make sure they can move around and stuff. Then figure out where the velcro squares align and uh, I'm gonna put my velcro right here and right here okay and then just sew your velcro thing on or stick them on and uh, once you have that you should be done your uh, latches you put them around or through your belt secure them on put your thing in the pouch and put it back so uh, 
here's the finished product. I just put a little design thing right there on the tape, but um, opens up. You can stick your item in there. Let me put mine in. Alright, it's in there. And then just wrap it around Velcro. It's not coming out. And then take your belt and just put it on. And uh, that's just about it. Simple little pouch to hold whatever you need. Um, yeah, easy access. So uh, hopefully you enjoyed this. And uh, thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe if you have any questions. Leave a comment or send me a personal message. See ya.